Your battery will only last a few years, then it will need to be replaced and the old one will be dumped in landfill creating a huge environmental problem. Have you heard that one? Well, Dave takes it on, investigates the facts be behind this and other statements made against EVs to see whether any are true. If you like this video, please subscribe so that you're notified when we release the next in the series. I'm a great fan of Blackadder and Mr Bean. I was surprised to find Rowan Atkinson making this and other claims on a video clearly against EVs. Link to that video down below. He makes several statements and one that stood out was that the average battery lasts for 10 years then needs to be scrapped. So what's the truth? All EV manufacturers offer a warranty on their batteries. None are less than 8 years and most have a limit of around 150,000 miles. So fact one, batteries are unlikely to need replacing within eight years. Oh yeah, there will always be unexpected failures before then. That's exactly why they offer warranties in the first place, because they are unexpected. Rowan also states that most people change their cars every three years. So most drivers will never need worry about changing their battery. But what about his 10 year claim? Well, the average driver in the UK drives less than 8,000 miles a year, although this figure dropped dramatically during recent years with lockdowns and travel bans. The source of this is the UK Department of Transport National Travel Survey. So at the end of 10 years, an average driver will have driven around 80,000 miles. Elon Musk states in writing, Tesla batteries are built to last for the full lifespan of your car, between 200,000 and 500,000 miles. The average person drives 273 miles a week, so you can expect your Tesla battery to last anywhere from 15 to 35 years, depending on your driving habits. That three, 273 miles per week is in the US, in the UK, the equivalent figure is 160 miles per week. Now, we also released a graph showing battery degradation after 10 years for the Model 3. And this shows a total degradation of 12% after 10 years. And these figures include some cars that have covered 176,000 miles. In plain English, battery degradation means that if your new car could cover 200 miles on a single full charge, after 10 years, it would then only be able to drive 176 miles on the same full charge. Still easily more than the average UK driver covers each week, meaning after 10 years of use, it still only needs to be charged once a week. Now his next statement was contradictory. He encouraged drivers to keep their ICE cars longer, saying they could be good for up to 15 years. And then said if he was asked, he would recommend an EV to someone who had an old diesel car and drives mainly in the city. And this advice is totally in line with government efforts to remove dirty old diesel cars from our streets. Now, I totally agree we should keep our cars longer. We have become a throwaway society. Cars are now good for 10 to 15 years. We should keep them longer. Definitely EVs, just not the old fossil fuel powered diesel smoke bombs. Conclusion. EV batteries are generally good for about 15 to 20 years, which is also the expected lifespan of the car they are in. When they do need replacing, so too probably will the car itself. They're also 99% fully recyclable, and this is the subject of a future episode, What Happens When Your EV Battery Finally Dies? Thanks for watching. I'm Dave.